Hey guys, the chicken is here. We are back today with another home gym video. And in today's video, guys, we have some pretty big news this week. So um, everyone knows, oh, actually, hold on one second. While you're waiting for me to waddle my, my fat ass back over there, um, make sure to hit the subscribe button if you like home gym content. So this is the only thing that I have from Go Strong, and I believe these are going to be soon unavailable because Rogue, as I said, has just purchased Ghost Strong. So what does this mean? Now, <clears throat> first let's talk about Rogue and talk about Ghost for uh, for just a second. So Ghost Strong became kind of the, the Lamborghini of, of fitness equipment, if you will. Very, very high-end stuff, very expensive, arguably made the best equipment in the game. So to see Rogue purchase them is definitely an interesting move. Um, and we'll talk about maybe what that could look like. It's, it's, I don't believe, I wasn't able to find anything that was hard set either way on, on whether Ghost is keeping their employees and all their products are going to be, um, still being made by Ghost or if that's all going to be, uh, shifted out by Rogue. Actually, I did read a little on that. So get to that in just a second. But yeah, they were purchased out, uh, through Rogue. So now anything that you want to buy Ghost Strong, I believe it's still on their site for the next, like, a few weeks or so uh i think it's just their roller cups and something else um but everything else it's going to be coming through rogue so definitely an interesting move i think the reason they did that is because ghost had a some sort of patent on their roller j cups so i imagine rogue is going to redo those and um you know i think it's great i could never afford a pair of uh ghost roller cups i mean to come to canada they were well over a thousand dollars for j cups that is ridiculous but um very cool looking very cool looking so <clears throat> here's what i know in terms of uh what's changing so all uh, in, in from my perspective what makes sense is rogue purchased ghost um in order to get around the uh the roller j cup patent so ghost had a patent on their roller j cups that's why you didn't see a bunch of other companies come out with them um and i mean there's roller style ones but they're just not as they're not as good so Seems like that might be a way for Rogue to get around the patent. I'm not 100% sure uh, on if that's true, but I think that was uh, definitely one of the one of the main reasons or an attractive reason to to purchase them. Next is they were you know they were kind of in competition with each other. I mean they both sell gym equipment. Ghost is uh, you know kind of the the premier. Rogue is you know very good, but uh, you know con not considered um, top quality. If you're looking at some of these like European companies like Watson dumbbells, for example. Um, but yeah, so it's an interesting move, and I believe from what I saw uh, is that Rogue is not going to make everything that Ghost used to make, so some of the stuff is just going to be gone. Um, from what I understand, Rogue is definitely taking on the J-Cups, they're taking on um, a couple other things, and you know, it's going to have like the Ghost logo and stuff on that. We've seen uh, Bill Henniger, uh, the owner of Rogue, he, he um, posted on his Instagram a couple things um, that they are actually working on. And I believe, uh, I forget the guy's name from Ghost Strong, the owner of the company. I think it was Tim, not 100% sure. He posted, um, you know, a, a big, long kind of explanation. It was really nice. It was well-written and stuff. But just explaining why he wanted to sell the company. It wasn't a money move. He was just done with it. And I guess he, he did something else. And this was just a side gig. So um, from what I took from, from his little blurb was that the Ghost Strong right now that makes all of the equipment, um, all of those people are not now working for Rogue, they're going to be working for the parent company, some sort of other larger manufacturing business that, you know, did the Go Strong, Strong stuff on the side. Um, so I think they're all kind of staying where they are, even though they're, they're going to be making different things. Um, and I don't believe Rogue is taking on any of their employees. I think they're simply just taking the, um, you know, the company and the products and the, you know, the business rights to, to make the equipment. And I think they're going to do all of that internally. So it's interesting to see, you know, if the price is going to come down or if the quality is going to be different on some of these products um, that Go Strong used to make. It's definitely an interesting move. Um, but yeah, I think that's all we really know about it for uh, for right now. But I'm super excited for one thing and one thing only to come of this uh, is Rogue by Ghost uh, Roller J Cups or whoever that would look. And hopefully they come in at a decent price point. I mean, the way Rogue's been going lately, like, they, they're, some of their stuff is the same price as some of the Ghost stuff. So, I mean, to say that they're, like, uh, a cheaper alternative or whatever, um, it doesn't even make sense. They're kind of, like, the same uh, right now. Ghost's a little bit more expensive on some things, but, um, yeah. 
So that's the interesting home gym news we got for you this week, guys. A little bit sad at first because, uh, you know, I wanted to get more stuff from Ghost when, uh, when we were able to. But I am, as I almost fall over, I am super happy that I was able to uh, snag this bad boy. I, I love this deadlift jack. Um, you don't have to get this super fancy one, obviously. Just the singular deadlift jack is uh is awesome i think it's actually clever this is like a combination clever by ghost or something like that so yep that's uh that's all we got for uh for this week guys but i want you guys to chime in uh i'm sure there's some stuff that i missed so let me know um if you have heard other things or you have more details on this situation between ghost and rogue i think it's an interesting one and i'm definitely going to follow uh to see you know how it turns out in uh you know to to see what rogue is is going to actually be making and um yeah it's interesting if nothing else so let me go let me know what you guys think down in the comments catch the next one chicken out back right